Let's talk about one of the rarest blood types in the world, AB. Most people have heard of ABO, but AB, it's the least common of all the major types. Only about 4% of the global population has it. That means out of every 100 people, maybe four have AB blood, and that alone makes it interesting. But there's a lot more to it than just rarity. In today's episode, we'll explore fascinating facts about AB blood. Fact one, ABO is the rarest ABO blood type in the world. Only about 4% of the global population has AB blood. It's even rarer in some countries. In the United States, it's less than 5%. That means if you have AB blood, you're part of a very small group. It's like being in a club with only a few members. Fact two, AB blood is the newest of the main blood types. It's believed that AB blood developed within the last 1,000 years. That's quite recent in terms of human history. Scientists think it came from the mixing of people with A blood and B blood. Before global travel and cultural mixing, this combination was almost impossible. So in a way, AB is a symbol of human connection. Fact three, AB people can receive blood from anyone with A, B, AB, or O blood. This is why they're called universal recipients. Their immune systems don't attack A or B antigens. That gives them the ability to receive red blood cells from any ABO type. In an emergency, this can be life-saving. But there's a catch. They can only give blood to other ABs. Fact 4. AB blood is more common in some parts of the world. While it's rare globally, it's slightly more common in places like Korea, Japan, and some parts of Central Asia. In Korea and Japan, around 10% of people have AB blood. This might be due to historical migration and genetics. In contrast, it's very rare in South America and parts of Africa. Fact 5. AB blood has both A and B antigens. This is what makes it unique. Type A blood has A antigens. Type B has B antigens. AB has both. But that also means people with AB can't donate to A or B types because their blood contains both antigens. It's a trade-off. You can receive from many but give to few. Fact 6. AB is the only blood type that doesn't make antibodies against A or B antigens. This makes transfusions easier for them. Their immune system is more accepting when it comes to receiving blood. That's why doctors often prioritize AB patients when matching donors, because they have more options. Fact 7. AB blood can be either RH positive or RH negative. AB positive is the most common form of AB. It's also the most universal, able to receive red cells from anyone. But AB negative is incredibly rare. Only about one in 167 people have it. In some countries, that's less than 1% of the population. For these individuals, finding a matching donor is extremely difficult. Fact eight, people with AB blood might have slightly different reactions to stress. Some studies have shown that AB individuals may have higher levels of cortisol, the stress hormone. This doesn't mean they're more stressed, but their bodies might respond to stress differently. It's not a huge difference, but it's a small biological detail that sets them apart. Fact nine, a B blood might influence the way a person digests food. There is limited but growing research on how blood type affects digestion. Some theories suggest that AB blood types produce less stomach acid. This could affect how they digest meat and protein, but it's not a rule. Diet and health depend on many other factors too. Fact 10. A B blood was extremely rare in ancient times. Before international travel and mixing of populations, A B blood was almost non-existent. Most people had type O or type A. The B antigen was more common in parts of Asia. It wasn't until the past thousand years that A and B antigens combined in one person. That's when A B first appeared and slowly spread. Fact 11. A B blood type is not related to personality. Some cultures, especially in Japan and South Korea, believe blood type can influence personality. AB is often described as mysterious or complex. But there's no scientific proof of this. Blood type does not control your personality or behavior. It's just a genetic trait, nothing more. Fact 12. AB people can only donate red blood cells to other ABs. Because their blood has both A and B antigens, it could trigger immune reactions in A, B, or O recipients. So while they can receive from anyone, they can only give to their own type. That's why A, B blood is in high demand for plasma donations. More on that soon.
Fact 13, AB plasma is universal. While their red cells aren't universal, their plasma is. Plasma from AB donors can be given to anyone. That's because AB plasma doesn't contain anti-A or anti-B antibodies. Hospitals love AB plasma for emergencies, trauma care, and burn victims. So if you're AB, donating plasma can help more people than you might think. Fact 14. AB people may be at higher risk for certain health conditions. Some studies suggest AB blood is linked to a slightly higher risk of blood clotting and heart disease. It's not a guarantee, just a possible correlation. Other factors like diet, exercise, and lifestyle matter much more. Still, it's a reminder to keep an eye on heart health if you have AB blood. Fact 15. People with AB blood are more likely to have cognitive decline later in life. One study from the University of Vermont found that people with AB blood had a higher risk of memory problems as they age. Researchers aren't sure why. It could be related to how blood affects brain function or how clotting factors interact with the brain. Again, this is just a trend, not a sentence. Taking care of your brain health is always a good idea, no matter your blood type. Fact 16. A B blood is useful for medical research. Because it's rare and unique, researchers often study AB blood to understand how the immune system works. It helps in fields like transplant science, cancer research, and transfusion medicine. Every drop of AB blood has something to teach us. Fact 17. AB individuals often have stronger immune tolerance. Because their immune systems don't produce antibodies against A or B, they may be slightly more tolerant of foreign tissues. This could affect how they respond to organ transplants or autoimmune conditions. Again, it's a small difference, but scientifically interesting. Fact 18. AB blood can affect fertility treatments. Some research has looked into how blood type might interact with fertility. For example, one study found that women with AB blood had more ovarian reserve compared to other types. But the data is not consistent across all populations. It's one of many factors that could influence fertility, not a cause or cure on its own. Fact 19. A B blood type is determined entirely by genetics. If you inherit the A gene from one parent and the B gene from the other, you'll have AB blood. It's the only blood type that needs both A and B genes. That's why it's relatively rare. Both parents must carry the right genes. It doesn't skip generations. And you can't change it. It stays with you for life. Fact 20. A B blood may affect how people respond to infections. Recent studies suggest that different blood types may react differently to viruses and bacteria. A B blood might have a unique balance, some benefits, some vulnerabilities. For example, people with AB blood were found to have a slightly higher risk of severe outcomes from COVID-19, according to early studies. But this area is still being studied and results vary. Your immune system is shaped by many things, not just blood type. Fact 21, a B blood is very important in emergencies, but hard to stock. Hospitals try to keep all blood types available, but AB is hard to store because it's so rare. If a patient with AB blood needs a transfusion, there might not be enough on hand. That's why blood banks often reach out directly to known AB donors. Even a single AB donation can save a life. Fact 22, a B plasma is often used in trauma centers. In trauma care, doctors need plasma that works for everyone. A B plasma fits the bill. It doesn't contain antibodies that could hurt the patient. In situations like car accidents or surgeries, a B plasma can be used immediately, even before the patient's blood type is known. It's like having a safe option when time is running out. Fact 23, AB blood helps in creating universal blood. Scientists are working on ways to make universal blood, blood that could be given to anyone. One approach is to remove A and B antigens from red blood cells. AB blood helps researchers understand how these antigens work. It gives them a model to study and test new methods. So AB blood is not just useful in the hospital, it's helping shape the future of medicine. Fact 24, AB people are often called universal recipients, but only for red blood cells. It's important to make a clear distinction. AB individuals can receive red blood cells from anyone, but when it comes to plasma, it's the opposite. AB is the universal donor. This confuses people sometimes, so it's good to understand the difference. Red cells and plasma play different roles, and AB handles both in unique ways. Fact 25. 
In organ donation, AB blood types have more options. Organ transplants require close blood type matching. People with AB blood are lucky in this area. They can receive organs from donors with type A, B, AB, or O blood, as long as other matches line up. This flexibility means AB patients may wait less time for certain organs. It's one of the few advantages of being rare. Fact 26. Blood type awareness is low, even among AB people. Many people don't know their blood type. Some find out only during surgery, pregnancy, or blood donation. For AB types, this lack of awareness can be risky. If you have AB blood, it's good to let your doctor know and consider becoming a donor, because in a crisis, your rare blood could be critical. Fact 27. AB blood is often studied in forensic science. Blood type can't identify a person, but it can rule people out. In crime scenes, forensic teams sometimes use blood types to narrow down suspects. Because AB is rare, it stands out. If AB blood is found at a scene, it tells investigators something unusual. It's not definitive proof, but it's a clue. Fact 28. AB blood may influence how someone reacts to certain diseases. There's growing research on how blood types interact with illness. Some studies found AB types have slightly higher risk of certain infections. Others show that AB blood may respond better to certain treatments. The science isn't finished and not all results agree. But the idea that blood type plays a small role in disease response is gaining interest. Fact 29. AB blood types are rare, but not disappearing. Sometimes people think rare means endangered, but AB blood is not going away. As populations continue to mix, AB could slowly increase. Still, it's likely to remain the least common. That's why donation is so important, especially for AB negative individuals. You never know when someone might need your exact match. Fact 30, a B blood connects people through generosity. When you give blood or plasma as an AB donor, you're helping people you'll never meet. A newborn in the NICU, a car crash victim in surgery, a cancer patient receiving treatment. These lives depend on rare blood types like AB. It's one of the most direct and powerful ways a person can help another. No fame, no reward, just quiet, life-saving action. So what have we learned? AB blood is more than just rare. It's useful in emergencies. It offers unique advantages in transfusions and organ transplants. It has complex biology that scientists are still trying to understand. And it shows how something invisible inside us can quietly change lives. If you have AB blood, you're one of the few. Not better, not worse, just rare and incredibly important. And if you don't have AB blood, you still play a vital role. Every blood type has its place. Every donation matters whether you give blood, learn your type, or just share this knowledge. You're helping build a world where we understand each other just a little more. Thanks for listening. Stay curious, stay informed, and if you can, donate blood. Someone out there might be counting on you.